Hello webmasters, today I'm going to show you how to create FTP accounts. Here I am inside of my cPanel dashboard. Your hosting provider may look a little bit different, but all you have to do is find where it says FTP accounts right here. It's usually under the files section. Let's click on that. And now you can add FTP accounts. Basically create a new username right here. I'll just call it demo one and then select the domain. If your cPanel account has multiple domains, subdomains or multiple add-on domains, you can choose which one this FTP account can access. So for example here, I'll choose my subdomain demo.howtowebmaster.com and this is especially useful for when you hire a developer or a programmer to set up a site or an app on your website and you don't want to give the programmer access to your entire site and only just the folder or you can actually down here set the directory to whatever directory you want to give access to so you can customize your folder right here and then down here under the quota you can set how many megabytes this person this account can transfer to and i'll just leave it default as unlimited now click on create ftp account and then down here account created and you can see the number of ftp accounts that you created down here you can also change the password the quota or delete it right here so to log in to your FTP account using FileZilla or pretty much any FTP program for here this demo I'm just going to use this online FTP program your host name is usually your server IP address your cPanel account IP address or even your domain and then your username is exactly like you created when creating your FTP account so right here that is your username the whole entire thing with the at sign and then your password you just type it in as is and then let's try to log in and the port just leave that blank default is already 21 now connect and again you can use filezilla or whatever ftp program so currently my subdomain is blank so there's nothing to see here but that's how easy it is to create an ftp account and then showed you how to log in with it okay i hope this helps thanks so much for viewing let me know if you have any questions down below and thanks again for watching